Hey, welcome to my channel. It's Danelle. I have a lot going on right here. I am going to try to do some simple kind of wave water looking nails with a, some little gold dolphin embellishments. And I also have some hex loose glitter here in this blue and this kind of pearly white. And first I'm going to, I'm going to use Melody Susie's P15, this really nice light blue color from their Fleurwe series. I'm going to lay down that as a base and then I'm going to go in with stamping polish and stamp on some French tips with the fluid art look to it. I don't know if the camera's gonna pick it up, but my dog is <laughs> sleeping and she's snoring. She used to only snore occasionally, and now she is snoring almost every time she's sleeping, which is most of the time these days, the older she gets. So loud. Uh, the dryer is also gone and I didn't close the door. So that might be a little back line, back, uh, background noise as well. All right, so that's the first coat. I'm gonna go ahead and put those in the lamp and get those cured. Okay. There's that first coat. I think I'm going to just do one coat just so that I still have some of that um, little bit of translucency for water. And let's see. I was thinking these look the most like water to me. So that's what I'm going to go ahead with. Look how easy that was to get a French. So there's three sizes of French on this plate and the this one is three sizes for this design and that one's a little too narrow so I can only use the middle and the far right.
off of there. Oh my goodness, and see how we're doing. I really like how it looks. Okay, I do have to clean off my plate to use those two again. I'm not being too picky about the sides because I'm using the bigger one so it's gonna way overshoot it. One thing to kind of keep it consistent is I am trying to line that up right in the bottom of the image, right on the tip so they lay the same. And it went on correctly, but just the way it falls, this one looks a little sparse. Yeah, okay, yeah, that looks better. Okay, I just wanted to add just a speck. All right, use this middle one for that pinky and that'll be plenty big enough. The small one might have been enough, but I didn't want to take chances, so we're just going to go with this. Just the way that the open space falls on the stamp, whenever I would do it, it would just kind of leave that little bit off. Look how cute. Looks like water, right? I think so. I think it looks like some gentle cresting, crashing waves, whatever word is appropriate. <clears throat> okay, so let's see. I'm in, I was finishing up my test now. I hadn't finished applying the glitter. And I was doing it off camera just because I wasn't sure how it was going to work. I wonder if base coat will smear the stamping. It, it may. It may smear the stamping. Let's try it on the pinky and see. Because I need base coat to apply the the glitter and the um, little dolphins. I'm trying to float it super gently and not let my brush touch, touch the um, stamp. Okay, I think it worked. All right. I'm not super happy with using this picker thingy, but I'm not I'm not real sure what else to use. I don't like how the base coat gets on it and sticks. Can you see I'm kind of off frame, I'm sorry, like usual. And I'm just doing this super random. And I didn't want a dolphin on every nail. I think that might be too much. But I definitely wanted the glitter.
or something on that I didn't like. Okay. There seems to only be two sizes of glitter in this bucket. There's the um the big hexes and then the small circles, which is okay, but I wish there was a little more variation. Oh, I guess there are some other tiny circles. But they're more like dust. I'm going to go ahead and put those in the lamp. Let's see how that goes. All right, so this is kind of what I'm going for. I, I like it. I hope y'all like it. I also have... <coughs> Excuse me. Always coughing when I start doing videos. Oh, I'm always coughing anyway. So I also have some itty bitty mermaids as well. Oh, these are the dolphins. I have them somewhere, maybe. Yeah, I have some tiny, tiny mermaids. And get a couple out because I only want All right. see the tiny little mermaid I think I only want one I also have some turtles but I don't know if they really go with that because they're huge compared to the dolphins and the mermaids so the proportion might be a little off all right that's out of the lamp i'm gonna go ahead and top coat it and see what we have Gorgeous. All right, I'm gonna cure it. All right, yeah, so I really like that. I think it looks good. I'm happy with it. Let's move these down now. Okay, let me see if I can find another tray for the pearly glitter because it's on the So it's a little late in the summer for some people for mermaid nails, but I live in Southwest Florida, so I didn't mean to pour that much. And mermaid nails are always super popular. So. All right, there's that pinky now. And I did size these tips for my own nails in case I decide I want to wear them. I'm really liking how this is going, so let's continue. I don't need the stamping stuff anymore. So I'm just gonna push that out of the way I bought that. I kind of still need this a little bit though because I was wiping off on it. <coughs> I think we'll do the mermaid on the middle now. Let's see. Yeah. 
Yeah, that'll be cute. Free sticker. Yeah. All right, I'm just going to get this stuff on because I'm making a mess. This is a little kind of wonky. I don't know, it's kind of weird to use. Thin layer of base, and let's get some glitter on. This is just glitter I got. I don't know. Probably on Timu. like it going into the water. Ew. I don't want them on top of each other either though. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and cure this one. All right, Jazzy. All right, oh, go ahead and cure it. All right, this one is out. And so I'm gonna go ahead and top coat this. I'm using a nice thick layer of top coat just to really encapsulate those glitters. I think this one will get a dolphin as well. Yeah. All right, I gotta take the dog out. All right, I had to jump up and that piece coat is kind of moving. Probably help if I kept things closer to me, right? Instead of stretching my body.
I kind of like how the white ones look like bubbles coming out of the water. All right, I think that's enough. That might be, I might have got a little carried away. This blue from Melody Susie, I think, is the perfect color for water. That light blue ocean water, especially with just the one coat. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and cure that. fresh out the lamp. I am super happy with these. I think they're super cute. Except that darn mermaid. That mermaid got me. But I really like it. If you like this video, hit the like button, comment, share, let me know what you think and subscribe so you get notified of future uploads like this. Thanks for watching. Until next time, bye.